Now, John Kelly, you were born in this house how long ago? Uh, in 1930. 1930. Long time ago. Not bad. You've seen some changes in your time. Well, believe it or not, I, not that much. Not that much. Has the town changed much, Westport? Uh, well, the personnel have. A lot of the shops have changed hands. How long are you in the shop? We're here at 70, 1871. 1871. And who was in this place before you? Who owned it before you? Well, uh, my father was here. My grandfather was here. You know who owned it prior to 1871? Who did you buy it off? He was a doctor. And was it always a craft shop? It was always a grocery shop. It was a grocery shop. And animal feed. And when did you change to the crafts? Yeah, about five, five or six years ago. Only that, five or six That's years. Oh, okay, right. Yeah. And how many people worked in the shop over the years? Was it always family only? Well, we used to have three or four staff. Was it the same size of the shop now? Same size. Same size, yeah. You didn't have a bar in it, no? We had a bar. You had a bar. But we never did any business in the bar. But you could buy a drink here? Yeah, we sold drink. We sold drink, yeah. But we didn't sell much. It wasn't a busy pub as such, it was more grocery and... Yeah. And where did your customers come from? Drummond, principally, round the rig. And why did the Drummond people come here? Well, had you connections? My grandfather came from Drummond. And where did you go to school? Christian Brothers. In Westport. And who was teaching you in the Christian Brothers that time? That said the primary school, national school? Well, it was a James Roddy, he was a English teacher. And uh, Christian Brothers. Okay. And what was school like that, like that time? Was it pleasant or...? Was it was pleasant, it was pleasant. Yeah. I always got out well. Were, were, they, were there corporate punishment there that time? There were, but I, I don't ever recall being hammered, you know. Yeah. Were many of the other pupils hammered? Were. Yeah. They were the poorer children. They would be poorer. Would they tend to be poorer? They would, yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Did you go to the secondary school there? Uh, uh, no, I didn't. I quit about halfway. And you went into the business? I came up to the shop then. Okay, right. So. And have businesses changed much in your time? It has a lot. A lot of changes in personnel, personnel, as you said before. A lot of changes, yeah. Did the supermarket have a big, a big impact on the business? Supermarket changed everything. They have changed everything. What was Westport like when you were young? Was it busy? Uh, Thursday it was a busy day, market day. Market day. And where was the market held? Right outside the door. You're in the octagon. I did have uh, carts of hay, three or four carts of turnips, potatoes principally, potatoes out there, top of the stone. <laughs> top of the stone. That was cheap. And would there be many people at the market? There would be a big crowd. Big crowd, yeah. Buyers and sellers. There would be a lot of people. They would mm. come from Ackham, Connemara, Round Lena.
And what did you do as kids or young people when you were growing up, like in your teens and that kind of stuff? How did you entertain yourselves? Or did, was it all hard work that time? No, you say it's going to the ball alley across the way. We play a bit of handball. Mm-hmm. Wasn't much good though. Was there anything else? Like you had no television or No. You had radio? Yeah. Did you listen to it much? A fair bit, yes, in mm. the evenings. Yeah. Did you go to the cinema? Huh? Did you go to the cinema? Uh, nearly every night. Nearly every night, yeah. And was it expensive to go to the cinema? One and four pounds. One and four pounds. What year did that be in the 40s and 50s, is it? 50s, I suppose. The 50s. Did you go dancing? We used to. We had a dance hall down there. And We had two dance halls. We had one down in the lecture hall. That's across from the... From the church. The church, yeah. And who used to play there, can, can you remember? Peter Gavin from the show. Did he band? Band. What kind of music would he play? Oh, he was fully equipped, modern and dancing. Music of the time, yeah? Yeah. And where was the second dance hall then? Hovens uh, on, on the middle of James Street. The ideal cinema. It doubled up as a cinema? Yes. Mm, that was handy. And would the dance be after the film or on a different night? Different night. Different night, yeah. How much was it to get into a dance that time? Half a crown. Half a crown. It was hard to get a half a crown, was it? Huh? You had your allowance and we had to manage on that. Mm. Had you uh, many brothers and sisters? I had three brothers. No sister. No sister. And were you all in the business or just yourself? Well, my oldest brother Peter, he went to Castlenock. School. And my br brother James went to Toome to become priest. Two priests? Two. Two priests in the family. So you were stayed behind to mind the business? When I was in the shop. Mm. And you're still in it? When you look back on life, are things better now than they were then, or were things... Well, they were all right for us, you know, yeah. to tell you the truth. You had we a were comfortable. You were comfortable, yeah. But for the rest of the country, for the rest of the population... Uh, there was a lot of hardship. Was there a lot of poverty here? There was. There was a lot of... Was there immigration? All the time. All the time. Did many of your class immigrate? In school? Most of them. Mm. Most of them. England and America. Yeah. So what do you think of Westport now? It's a prosperous town. Mm. Of course the supermarket here is big time. There are a lot of supermarkets now. There's one here on the corner, O'Connor. O'Connor's? That's the principal. You knew the O'Connor's back over the years, eh? Sean, sure, yeah. Sean O'Connor. Started in the fair green, did he? He was on the corner. He worked, he worked in Michael Heenan's in the early days. Mm. He was from Patry or somewhere up there. Mm. Do you think that the kids have changed much? The youth? 
from when you were young. They're much of a different than them. Well, we were basically poor like you know, yeah. the children today are better off. Yeah, they're probably better educated, are they? I I, I wouldn't say it's any better, but uh, maybe yeah. How about behaviour? Well, as far as I'm concerned, the, the behaviour is excellent. Mm. 